guys, it's Rosalie with Off Leash Canine in Philly. Today we have Milo, a six month old Labradoodle who just started his two week boarding training program today. Milo's coming in because he has a solid foundation. Mom worked really hard on getting his obedience top notch. The only issue that they're having is she has some health problems and because of it, he, they weren't able to pay like a much attention to Milo while she was in the hospital. So they put him in dog daycare and when he came back, he kind of started developing all the bad behaviors, whether it's barking, jumping on people, kind of just thin or puppy issues. So they just want to get him back to a point of being on top notch. The other issue is that they don't really have a fence in the yard and they want him to be able to run around and run around free off leash. So they want just like strong recall and just a solid obedience just to make sure when they say come or they say sit that he follows through with the commands. So let's see what he knows. Milo, come. Good job, buddy. What's up, Milo? Sit. Sit, sit. Milo, down. 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 Place. Milo, place. Place. Milo, heel. Good job, buddy. He wouldn't go into a set, but it looks like he does have a solid foundation. We just need a little bit more reinforcement. So come back in two weeks and let's see how he does.
My name is Kevin, and this is Milo. Mm -hmm. And we came to Off Leash Training to help Milo be the best dog he could be and to help address some of the, the issues that he was having as a puppy, uh, like healing and, and not uh, being excited around other dogs or other hikers that we see on, on the trail. Yep. So do you see a change in Milo's behavior and obedience? Definitely after the training, we have seen significant improvement. Uh, he knows how to take commands, hold commands, uh, and is happy to not only do that, but when he breaks from a command, he shows that uh, excitement as well. Good. And how did you feel about like the daily updates? The daily updates were unexpected, but fantastic. They were, they became over the two week period, something that we look forward to, not only to see Milo, but to see what he was learning and how he was evolving in, in that training. So it was awesome. Good, and would you recommend this to your friends? Definitely recommend to our friends, uh, recommend to anybody that's getting a puppy uh, or has a dog that they're just having difficulties with because it's a lot easier to have your dog trained than to take it back to the pound or back to a store um, or back to the breeder, if you will. Um, and and the, the off leash provides some advantages long term that uh, you, know, you, you probably envy that person that you see them without their dog on a leash and, and they're jumping in the truck to go somewhere. And you're like, I want a dog like that. <laughs> and that's what you can get. Yeah, well, Milo was a lot of fun. He did so good, very well behaved, and he, I'm so excited for you guys to enjoy that off-leash lifestyle, go on hikes with him all the time and all that. Thanks so much. Thank you.